Alright, we're on turn 8 of my AAR now. About to see the replay here. This is the Yontant. I'm going to try and get rid of a little bit of this German cellia that is coming out <coughs> in Belgium. This is a problem the Germans run into as they start getting past their supply lines. You can see that these supply values are pretty low throughout Belgium still. So this turn ends up being a little bit like our version of the Battle of the Marne. French come to fill up gaps. We've got a real solid defensive line going now throughout France. This Germans probably won't make it any further than they are now. Continuing to put a hurt on any German units on our border. It's so just a general reshuffling of the French border. British uh, battleships are now starting to take part and try and weaken uh, Austin, uh, the northern tip of Belgium. Just trying to slow and delay that German advance up that way. We'll probably find out in the next turn or two whether Belgium will be able to hold Ypres. As you can see, Antwerp is now completely surrounded. This is Montenegro. We're moving our full corps in, core in to Serbian front. Just shuffling troops around a little, trying to get a good solid front. The Austrians take a nice beating right here. Actually, get pushed back a little bit. The Russians are pushing in on the Austrians now. See, the Ru Russians are in pretty good control of Galicia at this point. One thing that's kind of nice about this mod is this is actually a pretty historical line at this point. Mainly with the Russians, we're just trying to uh, corner the fortress of Primizel and lay siege to it. There's an event that gradually lowers the garrison's morale. Moving headquarters up, consolidating lines. You can see the Austrians have a pretty good defensive line. They are a little banged up on their first row, so they're probably not going to do a whole lot of counterattacking this turn. They've done fairly well. They've given a good showing against the Russians this game, though, and, and they look like they'll be able to hold pretty solidly at this point. You'll notice I'm moving the headquarters up this way. That's to make sure that these units over here stay in pretty good supply. That finishes our replay for that turn. So we managed to destroy two German corps in that, that turn. Some Caucasian units arrived at Brest-Levotovsk. 
you'll see here the uh, Hermes under siege garrison morale reduced. If you notice here, we've got uh, this mod von Mackison and two reserve corps coming a bit early. That's uh, intentional because it's going to take them a turn to get set up and then probably another turn to really get on the move. I'm trying to replicate the um, November offensives into Poland. Hopefully put some pressure on Russia to have to uh, defend a little and, and not be able to push quite so hard on Austria. But uh, anyway, that wraps up this turn. and uh, Stay tuned for the next update.